Hey guys, it's Trish. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm showing you guys the top 5 best Dior purchases and also it's kind of saying what your first purchase should be from Dior. And yeah, if you're new here to my channel, please subscribe and also follow me on Instagram at Trish Trin and use my hashtag CDRholics if you want to share something with me or your latest purchases, anything at all. Just use the hashtag, tag me, and I'll come and like a comment on your photo. And also, this video was suggested by... Um, I'm not really sure how to say her Instagram name, but I'll put her Instagram right here and also link it down below. And yeah, if you suggest me a video down below and I choose your video, I'll give you a shout out just like I did for her. So yeah, if you have any suggestions, just comment down below. And let's get started with today's video. So this first item that I suggest you guys should get from Dior is a Dior book tote. So I really, really love the Dior book tote. You can use it for many things. You can use it for work, at the office, school, traveling. It's, I just love that you can use it for many things. So this one is the small book tote. And then here is the big one, or actually the regular size. Let me just grab it really quick. So here is the bigger one. I do have a, a comparison video between the two, so I'll also link it down below if you guys want to see that. But yeah, I definitely recommend getting a book tote because you can use it for many things. I love using my book tote for school and it can fit so, so much. So if you want a laptop to be in your book tote, I recommend getting the bigger size because if you use a smaller, it's kind of sticking out a little bit if you put a laptop in here. Um, overall, I think this one is kind of more for like hanging out or just going out. You can also use it for grocery shopping. Um, but yeah, the bigger one, definitely better because it can fit more and your laptop will not stick out. You can carry a lot and it's just, it's, and this big size is so light too. So it's light and the design is gorgeous. I love the book tote. Definitely recommend it as one of your purchases. It's just a Dior must have. And the great thing about the book tote, you can also customize it. Like me, I put my name Trish in the back and yeah, you can customize it any word you want. I can't remember um, what's the maximum letter? Definitely ask the essay there. But yeah, my name is really short, just five letters. And it's so cute. Christian Dior and then Trish. And then the next category, I'm going to say shoes because I recommend two types of shoes. So the first one are sling bags. So sling bags are super, super popular. A definite must have for heels and there's actually two versions this one is the shorter version and there's like a higher one but I prefer the shorter one um, it's easier to walk in and I don't know I just really really love slingbacks this gorgeous ribbon right here I had this so the size that I got was size 36 and I had them um, cut the ribbon to make it shorter because when I walk, it would keep slipping off. So they fixed that and now it's perfect. I love it. And with sling bags, I recommend getting the fishnet because um, if you were to get to like get the um, the harder material, it hurts the toes so badly. That's just my opinion. For me, it hurts. But the fishnet ones are comfortable and I love these sling bags. From far away, they look like black, but these are actually navy. It's like a dark blue. And then the next shoes that I recommend are Walk and Dior sneakers. So I love Walk and Dior sneakers. They are my favorite Dior sneakers. And I don't know, I just love collecting these. I think I have quite a few actually. And I don't know, I just love Walk and Dior a lot. Um, I do recommend like kind of massaging it. Um, it does hurt in the toe area in the front a bit. But the more you walk in it, it's really comfortable. I love it a lot. And I just get a 36, I'm size 36, at the bottom with the star, of course. Any walk-in Dior sneakers, I really, really recommend them. And it's just so detailed. I love the lace. It says Christian Dior. I love that. This is the blue denim one. And then the third item I recommend getting are Dior hats. So honestly, any Dior hat is amazing. You can get the baseball cap, the bucket hat or a beret. I just am so obsessed with Dior hats. They're so cute and my hat size for anyone asking is a 57 in a beret in anything and 57 in all Dior hats. So yeah this is the Dior Trois de Gris bucket hat and this is a part of the Dior like beach collection kind of. 
so cute. Yeah, you don't have to get this um, this pattern or design in particular. Any, like, even the oblique one. I had the oblique bucket hat. I love oblique. So, yeah, any Dior hat, definitely recommend. Because if this is your first purchase, just a hat, you can wear any outfit. And it'll look so cute. The hat stands out so much because it's a bucket hat. And it's quite big. It's so freaking cute. Let's see. Let's just put it on really quick. So I like putting it in the back a little bit so it's not really blocking my face like that. It's so cute, especially for beach pool day. Definitely recommend getting a Dior hat. And then the fourth item I recommend getting are any Dior SLGs. These are small letter goods. And this one is actually my first ever Dior wallet I ever got. It's so gorgeous. I love the color I chose and this has a little zipper in the back and this one has like the Diorama like shield and then you open it up a lot of card slots and then up here is for cash and yeah that is how it looks definitely recommend getting if this if this is going to be your first purchase definitely get either a card holder or a wallet they're amazing it's so cute just put it in your purse or if you don't want to wear a handbag, just hold the wallet around, right? And also even a card holder, maybe you can just put it in your pocket, like a men's wallet kind of. This is actually a men's card holder, but I'm using it for myself. I like it, so I mean, you can't really tell that it's men's, so yeah, I love it a lot. has two slots in the front, right? Yeah, two <laughs> and two in the back, and then one right in the middle. I think the middle would be good for like receipts. So yeah, definitely um, get the small letter goods. I love Dior little wallets and card holders. And then the final item is you need a Dior Mitsa scarf. It doesn't matter what design you get. Any design is just so gorgeous. This is actually the Trois de Jouy one. So why I recommend getting the Dior Mitsa scarf because they you can use it for so many things. You can use it as a scarf around your neck. You can even tie it around your wrist. You can tie it on your handbag handle. It's just so cute. It adds like that touch onto your handbag, and I just love it. You can even if you're wearing like a collared shirt, and you can put this around and tie a bow. It's so cute. I love it. And you can also use this as a headband. So what I would do is put it around like my neck, and then put this up, and then tie a knot right there, and then just twist it around. Then you have this big like scarf right here. It looks so cute. If you guys check out my Instagram or my other YouTube videos, I have a lot of videos where I'm wearing this. Um, but I will eventually make a video showing you guys different ways to wear the Mitsu scarf. So stay tuned for that video. And yeah, I definitely recommend getting all these items that I've showed you guys. These are the best purchases ever. Um, I do recommend a Lady Dior. It's just this video is kind of like for your first purchase. Something not too big, not too small. Something that is like a must-have. It's popular. You should get that. And out of everything I showed you guys today, the book tote, the hat, the shoes, the mitzvah scarf, and also small letter goods, I recommend getting this. This is... The cheapest out of everything I showed, it's around 200 to 230 USD. Um, it's just something small, you know, it's really cute, you can use it for many things. I would definitely recommend getting this the most out of everything. It's just a cute little touch, I love it. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you so much for her for suggesting this video. I'm so sorry I can't pronounce your username, but thank you so much for suggesting it. And please subscribe to my YouTube channel and also follow me on Instagram at Tristan and use my hashtag CDRholics and suggest a video down below and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!